Third down. Nine yards to go. Fourth down coming up. Brian Scott came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. Player lines up deep in his own territory to punt it away. Player gets the ball and punts it away. Hall fields the punt at the 39. The 45. Tackled at the D'Angelo the Hall gets some congratulations yeah, from his special on, teams coach on this one. See, he makes the catch. The Falcons come out on the field, and they're looking to extend their lead before halftime. They'll start at the 37-yard line. Passes incomplete. Griffith didn't haul that one Number in, and it falls incomplete. Receiver. Burt Berry Bert closed Berry. in from the zone and forced the incompletion. The defense stood up to that play and shuts down what would be a minimal gain anyway. It'll be second down. Vic cannons this one deep, deep left, and it's intercepted. One man to beat, no one in front of him. Brought down and... Cardinals offense has to score here. This drive will start at the 34-yard line. Gets past the line and chews up about four on the play. Second and six. Ball at the 30-yard line. McCown unloads this to the right sideline and it's tipped incomplete. Five-yard penalty. Repeat second down. Pete Kendall had no business being downfield on that one. He's supposed second to stay on his left. side of the line, so he was an ineligible receiver. Second down from the shotgun. Bolden snags the missile and is First at the 15. Hard. Tackled, and the clock will continue to run. It will be first down. First and 10. Ball at the 11. McCown zips it to the left sideline, and it's intercepted. Touchdown at the three. Jason Webster knew exactly where the ball was going on that last play, thanks to some great single zone coverage. His positioning got him the interception. That's their third interception of the game, and Peter, the D, is homing in on a passing game. A yeah, tough play. I love it. Falcons have turned the ball over the past two times out. They need to hold on to it as they... The Falcons take their first time out. Vic throws this one way down over the middle and it's knocked down at the line incomplete. Russell Davis swatted that pass away right at the line. That had potential for some yards, Peter, but the defense was on top of it and shut it down. Good denial there. Second down coming up. Second down and five wide receivers. Darnell Dockett next to his man in the backfield for a big loss. Time to make a stand. Let's make a stand. Ball at the Beck lets it go the distance here, and this one That's is incomplete. incomplete. With the deflection. Moore lines up in, in his own end zone for the punt. Dwayne starts to make the return. Moore takes the long snap and punts it away. Starks fair catches it at the 37. The Cardinals' offense takes the field with the clock at six. 
The Falcons will take a timeout and let the kicker think about it a little longer. Rackers launches the 53-yard attempt and can't quite. Scott Player had to use a butterfly net to bring the high snap down. What? The Falcons offense takes the field with the clock at two. And that'll do it That's for the first the half the of this play. one. The Falcons enjoying the lead 14 to nothing. And now let's... There's the signal, and we're ready. Rackers kicks it off to begin the second half. Rossum fields the second half kickoff at the three. <laughs> Tackled at the 27. Well, Peter, some interesting information up on the screen. Oh, you bet. They turned the ball over, but they have survived their mistakes. But you can't survive that kind of slap and play for long. It's going to come back to bite you. The Falcons' offense takes the field, and they will start at their own 27 yard line. Eventually pushed out of bounds at the 40. He's going the wrong way. First and he gets out of bounds at... Michael Vick does a little last-minute razzle-dazzle here. And he gets some yards. Well, Dan, we got an empty backfield, five receivers, and the defense is in their dime. Let's watch. Crumpler makes the catch on the right sideline, and that's a touchdown. Touchdown, Falcon. Michael Vick has time to make all of his reads before letting that pass go. Point after, and it's the extra good. point is good. The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Feely kicks this one away. Smith fields the kickoff at the 10. Drag down at the 23. Emmett Smith tried to run it out, but the defense preferred that he stayed put, and they made their case pretty forcefully there. The Cardinals him, haven't got him, much him. out of their offense recently, and we'll see if they can get back on track here. This drive begins at their own 23-yard line. Chris Draft was a one-man wrecking crew back there. He powered into the backfield and made the tackle. That's his second tackle so far. Second down, three wideouts in the game. Fitzgerald catches the left sideline, and he's looking for room. Finally popped out of bounds at the 38. Jason Webster eventually gets there, but I don't know why he even bothered. Big gain, and they'll move the chains. Well, he eventually stops them, but way past the marker, that one's going to hurt. They can't pin him down on second and long, and now it's first and 10. Very disappointing execution by this defense.
First and ten. Ball at the Cardinals' 38-yard line. Smith gets the sack at the 37. Brady Smith hauled down the quarterback for the loss of a little yardage and a lot of momentum there. They put a stop to this play behind the line of scrimmage. Pretty good call by the defensive coordinator. Agreed, Dan. They, they had it all locked up there. That will bring up second down. Third down, one man down. Looking is in behind the line of scrimmage. It'll be fourth down. Player gets ready to punt this away. Player gets the snap and punts it away. Kearney catches it at the 19. Tackled at the 25. Patrick Kearney got swarmed by the kicking team before he got very far. That nice punt pretty much goes unanswered. Falcons offense takes the field. They're in command, and they'll probably look to take time off the clock. They will start at their own 25-yard line. Dunn gets the toss and picks up eight yards on the play. Second down with the tight end right. This one will Passes fall incomplete. incomplete. With the deflection. I see run, I see run. Pro wing left, pro wing left. He's going the wrong way. One man to beat. Eventually runs him. Michael Vick does a little left. First down, two wideouts on the field. Vick unloads this one to the left, and he connects at the 16. Brian Fenner. And that'll do it for the third That's quarter. The, the Falcons quarter. in command of this one, 21 to nothing. Starks Passes makes a play on this and forces Dwayne the Starks incompletion. The deflection. Dwayne Starks came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. You know, as a team, they are Second batting down goal. passes left and right. Ball that the is their sixth <laughs> so far. Wow, great anticipation of the pass. Vic rifles it out left side and the ball's loose. Touchdown. Dexter Jackson delivers a punishing blow to the ball carrier. Cardinals want to capitalize on the fumble and will start this drive at their own three-yard line. Touchdown! Smith crushes him behind the line at the one. McCown throws this on a rope and it's tipped incomplete. Jason Webster got himself in prime position to bat away that football before the receiver even had a shot at it. That play would have set up a manageable third and short. But instead, they forced the incompletion. That's how the D is supposed to play. This pass will fall harmlessly to the ground, and it's incomplete. That will bring up fourth down. Anquan Bolden had that one come right to him back Jackson? there. You have to catch that those like passes, slow. baby. Peter in third down situations, they have not been successful at all with the pass. This play was more proof. Boy, third is so... Derek Ross is here to play, I tell you. What a stop on fourth down. It's worth another look. Oh, huge tackle. Huge. The Falcons fumbled the ball away last time. Let's see if they can hold on to it as they start this drive at the one yard line. Dunn gets the ball and... This is a good call here, Dan. These short yardage plays are... Here's 
the extra point, and it's good. The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Feely booms a beauty here. Smith downs this in the end zone for a touchback. The Cardinals were stopped on fourth down last time out. We'll see what happens as they start this drive at their own 20-yard line. Town throws a heater right sideline and it's knocked away from the receiver incomplete. D'Angelo Hall had that play dissected before it even started, really. Textbook zone coverage there. Potential for some nice yards. The defense plays it tough. That will bring up second down. Bolden down catches Cardinal. the bullet out left and is well past the markers for a first down. First down, tight end to the left. McCown zips it to the left sideline and it incomplete. is not reeled in. Incomplete. Was the intended receiver. Antoine Bolden had some room Number on the fringes there but the couldn't cover. reel in the pass. Another ball comes his way and another incompletion. To come up blank so many times in a row is, well, it's got to be demoralizing for a player. Absolutely, but you got to fight through the slump and grab one to get rolling again. It's intercepted. No one in front of him. And touchdown. Come on, give it up, baby. Touchdown, Falcon. Chris Draft takes off the ball, and he's going all the way. Nobody can... Now the extra point and the extra it's good. point is good. There's the signal, and we're ready. Feely kicks it off. Smith fields the kickoff at the 11. Tackled at the 21. Well, Peter, some interesting information up on the screen. Oh, you bet. Well, the turnover column has the grim news, in my opinion. If you want to win, you have to hold on to the ball. The Cardinals start this drive of the game from well in their own territory, and the clock at 1.57. Yes. The Cardinals take their first time out. Second down, 15 yards to go. Jones makes the catch out to the left and gets past the markers for a first down. Roughing the passer, number 97, defense. 15 yard penalty, automatic first down. That's returning. First down, the first clock is 10. stopped at 149. Cardinals 47 yard line. Rip. The Cardinals will take a timeout. That's their second. Second down and four wideouts in the game. Intercepted. Intercepted. down at the 46. Dan, that was a beauty of an interception. Perfect read and jump on the ball. Peter, you couldn't ask for more from him today. He has done his part. And then some. So far, he's got two interceptions. The Falcons will start this drive in midfield with the clock at 141. The Cardinals take a timeout. That's their final one. Second down with a split backfield. Ball at the 40 yard line. Griffith snags the dart right sideline and the clock continues. Adrian Wilson with the tackle. Keep him out of the zone, come on! Bro! Bro! One man to beat. 
15, 10, touchdown and Duncan at the eight. It'll be first and goal. Michael Vick dropped the playbook and improvised for a few, you, you know, like when I'll improv a catchphrase on the spot, something like, I don't, I don't know, can the yams, Martha? That was a doozy. Gerald Hayes closed in from the zone and forced the incompletion. The defense stood up to that play and shuts down what would be a minimal gain anyway. It'll be second down. Second down, the clock is stopped at 54. Vick ropes this to the end zone and it's tipped. Incomplete. Third down with the tight end line. No good. Incomplete. That will bring up fourth and goal. Fourth down and the field goal unit is on the field. Chris Moore holding. Feely with a 25-yarder, and it's through the upright. Jay Feely puts in an easy short one. A clean... The ref gets the signal, and we're set. Feely booms a beauty here. Smith decides to take it out of the end zone. Brought down at the 19. Emmett Smith took it out of the end zone, and while it may have been a little risky, he gets out close to the 20, so it all comes out in the wash on that play. The Cardinals will start this drive deep in their own territory with the clock at 40. McCown throws a bullet here, and it's intercepted. No one in front of him. Touchdown! Touchdown, Falcon! Brian Scott kicks off the ball. Here's the point after, and the extra point is it's good. good. There's the signal, and we're ready. Feely rockets this one deep. Casper decides to take it out of the end zone. Tackled at the 14. Kevin Casper decided not to down it, but couldn't even make First it to the 20, which may affect his Christmas gift from his special teams coach. We'll start this drive deep in their own territory with the clock at 28. Incomplete. Jason Webster came in and got a hand on that football and left no chance for a reception there. That is their fourth batted ball. Tell you, we've seen a number of good defensive plays from this squad. We sure have. We'll see if they can keep it up, though. Second down. The clock is stopped at 24. McCown rifles it out left side, and the catch is made for the first. The clock continues to tick down. McCown spikes the ball and that will stop the clock. Second down, the clock is stopped at 10. McCown throws a bullet to the flat and the reception is made for a pickup of maybe a yard. Third down from the shotgun. And that is going to do it for this one, the Falcons come out on top 45 to nothing. For my partner, Peter O'Keefe, this is Dan Stevens saying good.